legendary actor Sir Sean Connery has died. That's according to the official James Bond Twitter account. A uh, star in dozens of blockbuster films, Connery is best known for his role as the aforementioned super spy in the 007 franchise. He's also played seminal roles in other classics like The, Run the Hunt for Red October, Indiana Jones and The Last Crusade, as well as The Untouchables, for which he won the Oscar for Best Supporting Actor. Connery's career spanned more than five decades, and he just celebrated his 90th birth birthday back in August. NBC's Kelly Cobiea takes a look at his life and legacy. Sean Connery was the first, and for legions of fans, the best. The ultimate British spy, James Bond. Martini, shaken, not stirred. Did you have any idea it would grow to be what it has become? No, no, nobody did. Bond. Connery almost wasn't Bond. Creator Ian Fleming Fleming called him an overgrown stuntman. The son of a truck driver in Scotland, he joined the Navy at 16, but his rugged good looks got him noticed, first in a Mr. Universe contest. Show me a, 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 a Mr. Mr. Universe pose. But there was a world beyond Bond. Do you think I'm a god? Connery, the character actor. <laughs> he pulls a knife, you pull a gun. He sends one of yours to the hospital, you send one of his to the morgue. That's the Chicago way. The tough Chicago cop in The Untouchables. Unforgettable and Oscar worthy. I'm going to count to three. Sean Connery in The Untouchables. I thank you all sincerely. At the height of his superstardom, Connery's career nearly imploded when remarks made in the 60s resurfaced in the 80s. You think it's good to slap a woman? No, I don't think it's good. I think, think it's bad. It must, I don't think it's that bad. I think that it depends entirely on the circumstances and if it merits it. The damage was short-lived. The movie roles kept coming. Welcome to the rock. So did the honors, like People Magazine's Sexiest Man of the Year. Not the way Connery saw himself. Balding, 57, <laughs> slightly overweight. Uh, no, and uh, well, I, I'm not very good at uh, expressing what I think about me. Presidents honored him, the Queen knighted him. Sean Connery. The Scottish legend immortalized on late night. After half a century on screen, Connery retired from acting for good. I don't look back very much, to be honest. No matter the age, always Bond. James Bond. Kelly Cobiella, NBC News, London. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.